solving quadratic equations with substitution. Solve x to the power of 4 plus x squared minus 6 equals 0, where x is real. This is a quadratic equation, even though it might not appear so at first. But when you look at the relationship between the x terms, you will notice that x to the power of 4 is the same thing as x squared to be squared. So we could re-express our equation in terms of x squared. So the first term would be x squared squared plus x squared minus 6 equals 0. And if you look at this, we see what we have is a term squared and a term and then a constant term. So it's quadratic. It might be easier to see this if we make a little substitution. So if we let a equal x squared, then we could see that x to the power of 4 would be a squared. So we can write out our equation like that as having a squared plus a minus 6 equals 0. So now we want to solve this equation. So to solve, we'll factorize it first. This is a fairly trivial one to factorize. So the factors of a squared are a and a, and the factors of minus 6 that add up to 1 would be plus 3 and minus 2. Therefore, our solutions would be a is either equal to negative 3 or a is equal to 2. However, we want to know what x is equal to. And remember, a is equal to x squared. So x squared is equal to negative 3. So x must be equal to positive or negative the square root of negative 3. Now, since the square root of a negative 3 is not a real number, and we, we must have a real number for this answer, it's an imaginary number, it, it doesn't suit our purposes here because it's not real. The other option is that a or x squared is equal to 2. Therefore, x must be equal to positive or negative the square root of 2. This answer is okay. These two answers are real.